Nine protesters were arrested at the University of Minnesota campus this morning during a protest in support of Palestinian rights. This afternoon, a large group of students protested outside Kaufman Memorial. They heard from speakers who called for the liberation of Palestinians in Gaza. Earlier, a group set up an encampment on Northrop Mall. They were protesting in support of Palestinian rights to demand the university divest from companies and academic institutions they say support Israel. Some refused to leave when UMPD asked them to do so and were arrested for trespassing. The U says it supports and respects free speech, but tents are not allowed on university property without a permit. This follows a growing number of campus demonstrations over the war in Gaza. Chaos broke out at Cal Poly as police in riot gear broke up a pro-Palestinian protest, and dozens of students and faculty were arrested at NYU last night. At Columbia University, demonstrators chanted anti-Semitic slogans. Many Jewish students say they're worried about their safety. Those Jewish students themselves, even though they're young, their family members, in some cases, themselves experienced aspects of the Holocaust. And so when they see these chants, of course, they feel it deeply and they feel it in a post-traumatic uh, sort of way that uh, we're working so hard to eliminate. These protests come as Congress is poised to send billions of dollars in military aid to Israel and billions of humanitarian assistance for Gaza. That vote could come tonight or first thing tomorrow morning.